So yesterday, one of the more extraordinary things that's ever happened in my life took place. A chunk of tusk, elephant tusk, was found on, in the middle of the Urema Road and was brought back here and was shown to me and I looked at it and thought oh my goodness there's something really odd about this tusk it's got this fissure it's deformed belongs to a male elephant and I thought immediately I know who this tusk belongs to and it comes from an elephant called Aloisio who I first met in 2013 and I noticed that he had a deformed tusk. So this is one of his ID pictures, and you can see right here, this deformed tusk, it's sort of behind, it's sort of back behind his trunk, and you can see this fissure that goes up here. Another angle, you can see from the side where this tusk turns backwards. The other day when we were out, we saw the same male, and he was obviously having trouble. Uh, he kept reaching up into the tusk cavity with his trunk, uh, feeling it over and over again, and, and blowing dust up into it. So we thought at the time that, you know, he's obviously lost his, his tusk. It's either causing him dis some discomfort or he's just wondering, you know, how it, you know how you, when you lose a tooth yourself where you keep feeling with your tongue in there because it feels so odd. So we were kind of musing over, you know, what, what was the problem. And then how extraordinary that this tusk, which has actually been lying, you can see it's been lying in the, in the dirt somewhere for a long time. You can see that it broke off. Um, this is not the end of the tusk, there's still some tusk missing. Um, this is the, the nerve cavity here. I know from experience that elephants will pick up um, bones, but particularly tusks. And I have no doubt that an elephant found this in the, in the forest somewhere, carried it, and just happened to drop it on this road. We know this is not from a poached elephant because we know the elephant's still alive. We know which elephant this came from. We know that it wasn't found by people and you know cut off or anything because it's a natural break. Mm -hmm. There are the, there are one tusk elephants who are born that way, but they, there are also those who break their tusks close to the lip and expose the nerve, and then the, the tooth will rotten and, and fall out. Um, and we've seen that in other places where I've worked. He probably broke it either on a tree or in sparring with another elephant. Um, so yeah, this is a natural, natural occurrence, a very rare occurrence with this deformed tusk. And um, you know, it's just, just quite a wonderful discovery for me anyway.